Billy was hiding out in an abandoned farm near Stinkin' Springs. I threw in with the kid because the man I had sworn vengeance on was riding with Billy's enemies. But before I tell you why I want that some bitch dead, let me tell you what happened that day. I was heading back to the hideout when suddenly I had this funny feeling. Funny, haha? -ha? No, Steve. The other kind of funny. You heard Pat. You need to stay here and keep an eye on the road. That's not fair. We're missing all the fun. I knew those two morons would never let me through. I had no choice. What the hell? Shoot that, son of a bitch! Was it Pat Garrett's posse? Oh, yeah. I heard the shots and I knew I had to move fast. Fire and will! They're coming from Garrett the and his army of deputies had surrounded the entire homestead. I decided to help Billy and the boys out of here. So that's just what I did. Hey, you have one behind us! Stay on it! As the governor of New Mexico was paying for the kid's apprehension, Garrett was able to hire every gun hand in Lincoln County. Luckily, these shooters Garrett hired weren't the sharpest tools in the shed. A lot of them were saddle tramps or sod busters or drunken drifters looking to make it. Oh. yelling at me from the window. Back, Back door! door. We got we'll you. cover you! Watch your flank! You'd be told things weren't much better behind the house. I cut their numbers in half, but that just made the ones that were left twice as mad. It was a bit of a slog, but I finally fought my way around the back of the house. And like that, You're I was inside, dead, none the worse for wear. I passed Dirty Dave, and upstairs I found Billy and Get Charlie Bolton. in a trap! Billy looked at me and said, About time, amigo! Grab a gun and get to the window! Wait, so you were friends with Billy the Kid? Yeah, sort of. Anyway, we were surrounded by dozens of deputized shooters who wanted to do us harm. I can keep this up all day! I'm telling you, Garrett's men were dropping like flies, but they 
just kept on coming. <laughs> That's when Charlie got hit. They're catching us in a crossfire, shouted Billy. Get to the other side! Invincibility that many young men have. Like Jack here. What are you saying, old man? Jack is just joshing with you now. Yeah, he better be. Mr. Graves, please continue. Please call me Silas. <laughs> now, uh, where was I? You were heading for the barn. Right. Making my way past a passel of fallen foes. Sounds like Garrett hired a whole regiment of hired guns. And just when I thought I was done with them, more of these hapless bastards would pop up. <clears throat> Finally, I had the stables within my reach. <laughs> After the fight, maybe we could treat ourselves to some fried chicken. <laughs> and that's when I met. Sheriff Pat Garrett. I read that you went toe-to-toe -to -toe with him, sir. That backstabbing bastard with that tacked-on tin star. 